you know, I think we all understand the popularity of the Bengals these days. And popularity means interest from people on the outside, of course. Now, we can look at two things here. If you are sentimental, of course, you don't want the name to change. But there are a lot of fans out there who understand now might be the time to cash in. I've heard a lot of things. I've heard people say that maybe they'll try to keep the field a separate name from the stadium. For example, XYZ Field at Paul Brown Stadium. So what's in a name? In the case of a professional stadium, money and lots of it. I know that at the end of the day, I'm sure they don't want to change the name, but it's a different era we live in than when it was built, you know, 22 years ago. I think it's one of those things where if you can get some extra revenue, it's going to help in so many other areas that they figure let's at least kick the tires. A representative for Hamilton County tells me there have been many discussions over the years about the naming rights provision in the original lease agreement. And given the team's Super Bowl run, the Bengals indicated that they would be exploring options. But right now, the county has not received a naming rights proposal. As for the city, the manager says nothing is pending. But when the team is ready to engage, his office is prepared. But the name game on the street is a mix that breathes hometown loyalty. Ah, uh, I don't know. I was thinking maybe Procter Gamble, GE, Amazon. <laughs> I don't know about a corporate name. Maybe keep it keep it uh, NFL NFL base. Okay. I like the jungle. As long as the money or the naming relates to the city, to me that would be important. But there is one name that has become available that does not get any love from Bengals fans. How about Hinesfield? No way. Uh, no. <laughs> You would never accept Heinz Field as a name for... Oh, no. <laughs> no, not Heinz Field. No. <laughs> so I guess they don't like Heinz Field, but it is available if anyone wants it. You know, the original cost to build Paul Brown Stadium was about a half billion dollars. It's estimated that's how much it would cost to renovate this stadium over the next several years. Reporting live, I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News.